Hello everyone and welcome to this tutorial for installing and using CarPaint Collection for Blender. CarPaint Collection is not an add-on, it's a library for the Asset Browser. Do not install it in Blender as an add-on, right-click then extract. Once you've extracted the files, you can delete the zip file. Now go to Blender, go to Edit, Preferences, then File Paths. Click on Plus and go to the folder containing the blend file we've just extracted. Click on Add Asset Library and don't forget to save the preferences. Close this page. Open a new window in Blender and open the Asset Browser. In the list of assets, click on CarPaint Collection. The collection is now ready to use. Now all you have to do is select a category and click and drag it into your 3D scene. It's very simple and easy to use. Let's open a new window and see how the shaders work. For each shader, you have a fully customizable material. For example, metallic, car specular, roughness, flake size, flakes intensity, but also orange peel. These are the reflections we find here. When the varnish isn't properly stretched, you can accentuate it, or, on the contrary, erase it completely. Varnish can be activated or deactivated, but it can also be increased. Varnish roughness lets you add roughness to the varnish to give a different effect. And so it is for each material. For example, the tire, you can adjust the specularity or the roughness. Let's continue assembling our car, Piano Black. Let's go inside and choose leather. Brown leather for the seats and black plastic for the dashboard. For the wheels, steel for this part and gloss black plastic for the rest. And don't forget the red lights at the rear. We have our own fully customized car. We can easily add more original car paint like iridescent car paint. It's very easy to adjust hue, saturation and other parameters. We also have a collection of matte car paints, again customizable. Metallic car paint, but also everything to do with carbon with classic carbon. A whole host of customized parameters to adjust carbon size, fibers and varnish. We also have other types of carbon, such as forged carbon, a very interesting carbon that takes on all its splendor when you switch to cycles with really superb reflections. We also have camouflage shaders in three main families, square camouflage, camouflage with rounded spots and angular camouflage. And here again, everything in our shader is customizable. It's possible to change the size, the different colors, and to vary the pattern within our design. And that's all there is to know about the photorealistic materials created by B Productions. Thanks to all. Enjoy.